Olivia here. This is day one of the TBR Takedown Readathon. And today I did pretty good. I started Clockwork Angel. And I managed to read um, 274 pages. So yeah, I'm really excited about this readathon. And I'm going to try to do little updates like this and put them all in a video for you guys. It is day two, and roughly one o'clock in the afternoon. I am not feeling good at all, but I just finished Clockwork Angel, and it was really, really good. I managed to finish Clockwork Angel today, and I also started and finished Forget You. There were some things that annoyed me about this book. It's not my favorite new adult romance by any means, but towards the end, I was flying through it, and it was a really quick read. My total for today was 468 pages, which is awesome. I don't remember reading this much in a readathon for a very long time, but tomorrow I will be heading home to visit my dad and my boyfriend's family, so I don't know how much reading I'll be getting done in the next few days. Hey, it's day three of the readathon, and I ended up starting Clipped Wings last night before bed, um, and I continued it this morning. So I am now on page 286, and it's really very good. I can't wait to get to the second one, actually, too. I'm going to order that on Book Outlet pretty soon. And I am just in the car on my way to visit my family, so... I am hoping to finish this. I only have a little bit left. And then I'll be moving on to the next Infernal Devices book. Day four, and I just finished Clipped Wings. Uh, it's a book about this guy who is a tattoo artist that falls in love with a girl that works next door. Um, both characters are really flawed, and it ended on such a cliffhanger that I need the second book right now. A really good new adult romance. Just starting Clockwork Prince and hanging out with my favorite pup, Snooky. It's day five of the readathon, and yesterday, after reading Clipped Wings, I only managed to read 54 pages of Clockwork Prince. Not really happy about that, but I had other plans, and that's fine. Today, I'm going to the beach soon, and I'm hoping to get some reading done there. I'm going to do as much as I can because tonight I have plans with some friends and I'm really excited so hopefully I'll get to read a good chunk of it today and if not then I'll jump right back into it tomorrow because I'll be heading back home and reading as much as I can tomorrow night and Sunday. It is 8.30 a.m. and the last day of the readathon. I'm back home. Unfortunately, I didn't even film yesterday because I did absolutely no reading whatsoever. So, because of that, I am still reading Clockwork Prince by Cassandra Clare. I'm currently at page 145. Hey, it is now 5.30 and I've had a pretty successful day so far. I got all of my chores done and I went for a walk. And then I got to sit, sit down and do some reading. So I just finished The One and Only Ivan, and it was so cute. This is a middle grade book about a gorilla who helps out his elephant friend, and it really got me thinking about the animals in the zoos and the animals that are in malls, and it was just a really cute read that I will probably read again someday. I am also reading Clockwork Prince, and I only have about 100 pages left now, so I should definitely be able to finish this tonight. So now I'm going to get started on supper, and I will be so, so, so happy if I manage to finish Clockwork Prince, because that will mean that I did it, and that I met my goals for this readathon, which is awesome. Five books in one week is pretty good for me considering that I usually read about six books a month. Hey guys! So the readathon was a 
big success for me. I did end up reading the five books that I had picked out. I have them all right here. I won't go into details because I will be talking more about these books in my monthly wrap up. So I'm not going to give my full review on all of them yet. There was none that I didn't like. I think they were all four and five star ratings. So that's really good. And I really enjoyed vlogging too and making this video so I'd be down for doing it again if it's something that you guys enjoy watching. Let me know if there's other readathons coming up because I have a lot more time in the summer and I want to read as much as I possibly can. So thank you so much for watching. Please like and comment and subscribe and check out our blog. See you guys next time.